I'm quite a bendy. Like I can do, <laughs> I can do some things that are quite sort of like you wouldn't think. I've never liked the feeling of hair, like draping across me. You know, like if someone's got very silky, like even my own hair doing that. It's like... I think my favourite scenes were the scenes with Ray. It's just a pleasure working with him. He's like a master. So I, every moment I had with him, I was like, wow, this is really cool. Intelligent, caring, and uh, yeah, daring. Dogs. Oh, I'm a texter. I'm terrible. I'm too shy sometimes on the phone. Would be calm. The calm app. Uh, my sense of humour. Oh, definitely the 60s in London, because that was the place to be, kind of 64, 65, 66 that time. Have fun. Just have fun. Don't worry about it. I think I'd want to do something like be an astronaut or something like that, go into space. London, sorry, sorry LA, pizza. I'm quite a bendy, like I can do, <laughs> I can do some things that are quite, sort of like you wouldn't think. I think I'm quite a kind of liquidy person. I've got like my feet can go all the way around, like, you know, like I've got really good turnout. Flying. Total eclipse of the heart. Welcome to the club. Very clever. I drew from, well, first of all, my love of Mary Poppins because I've always loved Mary Poppins and it's one of my favourite films. I think she's kind of like my icon. Um, and it always, I've always been like, what would Mary Poppins do? I did a little research on the Bletchley women, the women that cracked code during uh, the Second World War and were these like kind of unsung heroes at the time. Mainly it was just, you know, Matthew Vaughan had written this great character. So um, I just kind of tried to bring her to life. Comedy. Countryside. Summer. Oh my gosh. At the moment I'm doing a Black Pudlian accent and I've been doing it for about four months. So it's sort of like sometimes I, I don't even know I'm doing it, you know? <laughs> it's like it's been in my body for so long. So that's my number one at the moment. I think I'd be a painter. I love painting. That's a hobby of mine. And um, I think I'd do that for a living. I used to be able to do the splits. But then one time I did them at a party and I buggered my legs up. So <laughs> that was my one thing. I don't know. I mean, that's hard. That's so hard because they'd have to be, I don't know. I have no idea. Who, who do you think? <laughs> I think they'd have to be someone that can be silly and not take themselves too seriously. Just people that are rude, people that are, you know, horrible to other people. Vintage. Singing. Like, chill out, just chill out. I get quite sort of, a um, lot of like, talk in my brain, like, blah, 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 blah. and so um, just trying to kind of just chill out is the main thing. We've just started watching, <laughs> I just watched Get Back and I completely, was completely obsessed. I mean, I thought it was one of the most amazing things I've ever seen. Silly, fickle, attentive, even though I'm fickle, I'm also attentive. Scone. I say gift, but I don't know. Cook my own. Oh my God. I mean, I hope I've got quite a few, I think. But my, the main one was when I auditioned for drama school. But on the day of the final audition, I, I got the worst food poisoning I've ever, ever had in my life. And I couldn't even stand up straight. And I did the audition and I got in. And I, I actually think it was the blessing in disguise because I'm usually quite high energy today. I think I just, it just took the edge right off. The Apartment. The Apartment. Uh, the last book that I read was called um, Exciting Times by Nisha Dolan. Aquarius. Heal. Snow. At the moment, it's um, this incredible woman I'm working with called Morwenna Banks, and she's a 
She's a writer, but she's also a comedian. And I just think she's so inspiring. She's absolutely amazing, very under the radar. It was painting because um, I always painted and drawn, but I really like kind of got sort of into it with oil painting. Spring, chocolate, underdressed. Yuck. Jarvis Cocker. So I feel like that, that would be a good dynamic. And then <laughs> maybe like a painter, like maybe like Dali or something like that. I love doing the Northern accent, gorgeous. We've got so many in the UK. Jack of all trades, coffee, <gasps> smaller gathering, Christmas. Work hard, but you know, have fun with it.